Hello, this is Vince from MTL Free TV. I want to do a video on Puffin Web Browser. So out there in the world of internet, there's plenty of websites that allow you to do live streaming. Uh, on the Android device, uh, some of the basic uh, web browsers, like the, the basic browser, Chrome browser, uh, we'll say uh, Opera, Firefox, you know, some of them don't have a Flash integrated or Flash integrated within them. That's where Puffin Browser comes in. So Puffin Browser allows you to go to these sites and be able to use uh, the website to the fullest. Uh, because there's a lot of websites out there that uh, you may not have, uh, or you may have maybe used on a PC and uh, to go watch your live uh, live channels. A lot of people who are from foreign countries, uh, especially Africa, you know, France and stuff like that, you're going to have these websites that stream content, but you're not able to watch it on your Android device or your Android phone or your Android box. Puffin Browser will bridge the gap between that. So I'm just going to show you um, like one website that I personally use uh, to watch uh, live content but even if there's other other ones that are out there you can always just do a search or you know friends or family that you know you can always inform yourself on them there's just so many of them out there but I just want to go over one of them and just open your eyes to the Puffin browser which is a very good browser probably one of the best for uh, streaming content online So downloading the Puffin Browser is extremely easy. It's just a matter of going into the Play Store or the Aptoid or whichever uh, store that you want to go into and then you're just going to download it. You put in the Puffin Browser, you do a search and open it up. I recommend that you download it directly from the Play Store uh, because it's constantly updated if you go through the Play Store as opposed to downloading it through a browser or downloading it through the Aptoid Store which is another kind of Play Store. Um, uh, alternate Play Store. Uh, either way, it's really simple. Come in, you click install, accept. You're going to download it. It's going to download. All right, and there you have it. So there's your Puffin browser. So we're going to just open it up really quick. Uh, it's going to give you a little bit of a uh, just show you what to do and all that. You can just click on that just to ignore it. Uh, one of the websites that I just want to show you, uh, obviously you can purchase the Pro if you don't want any ads or any pop-ups or anything like that. Always recommended to, to get the Pro just to show support for the uh, people that put to, uh, effort or they put time towards these apps. Uh, so you're gonna, just going to go in. Uh, one of the apps that I use personally is Assimilator TV, which is a, a channel for uh, French, French channels. Assimilator. Uh, Tour TV. So you could just do a search for that. Um, I believe uh, once you do it, it's uh, Opus TV or either way. So this is the website right here. You did the search, we found it. You're going to click on it, it's going to open up. And then once you click on it, you're going to find your channel. So your channels are going to be here, right? Obviously, if you want to play it in full screen, then you're going to be able to do that. You're going to be able to click it open, and it's going to open up in full screen, and then it's going to enable you to watch your shows in uh, full screen. So I'm not really going to play that for too long. So as you can see, it's going to give you access to, to these websites. So for example, if we want to access the same content through the default browser or through one of the other browsers, it wouldn't have the same setup. Um, a similar TV is a little bit different. Um, I wouldn't really give this as an example because they did make updates for it to work with uh, different players like you see you're going to be able to work it with an MX player or VLC but you're still not using it directly through the browser right uh, the the website has to set it up or the website has to make it available for you to be able to use it uh, in alternative ways or to fully use it on the Android box as opposed to the Puffin browser which just is unfiltered and just works the way it is and that's pretty much it so I just want to once again just show you the Puffin browser uh, show you the ability show you the um, the potential Puffin browser can give you and give you an extra dimension on the Android TV boxes. It'll give you access to websites because there's a lot of African content. There's a lot of um, Car Caribbean content, uh, European, stuff like that. Different websites that'll give you access to content that, you know, you might not necessarily want to use in Kodi or Mobdro or wherever. You might have a really good uh, version on this website and you weren't able to access it before because you weren't sure or if you go to the website. So Puffin Browser is going to give that to you and that is it. Thank you. Take care. mtlfreetv.com is the website. Thinking of getting your second, third, maybe even your first Android device. Maybe you even like a t-shirt of the logo. mtlfreetv.com is the place. We ship worldwide. mtlfreetv, the boards.net is the boards where you'll be able to keep up with all the updates and changes that I post up. 
tinyurl.com slash mtlfreetv is the mailing list, and mtlfreetv at gmail.com is the email. And don't forget the MFT installer. It's the best place for Android devices to get all their movies, TV shows, and streaming apps all in one place. And best of all, it's free. Free download, you go to the website, which is right on the screen, mtlfreetv.com slash mftinstaller. Like, share, and most importantly, enjoy. Take care.